Yo, what up? It's your boy Ron P. Appreciate y'all tuning back into the channel. So today I'm making a video on how to record in FL Studio. This is an updated video. The last video that I made, people had a couple questions and they still needed help. So I'm replying to those comments today and make sure if you got any questions about how to record, then just make sure you leave them in the comments and I will reach out to you directly or I'll make a video replying to your comment all right so make sure y'all subscribe to this channel so y'all will be updated when i drop videos all right so the first comment somebody asked they said quick question when i finish recording the recordings are aren't sent to the main vocal track with the preset i did the side chain and everything but the recording is placed on no mixer so i'm going to show you how to fix that problem if i understand it right all right so the first thing you want to do before you record this is my beat right here you want to double left click and you want to assign that to its own channel so i'm going to assign it to channel one okay the next thing you want to do you want to have a recording track which is right here track two and you want to click this and you want to come over here and find your microphone mine is this one right here yours is going to look different um, and then what you want to do is hover over this, you click this and go down to external and mixer input. You want to click that. All right. Let's say, for example, you want all of your vocals to be routed to the preset, which is track three. So what you want to do is click the recording track, make sure it's highlighted, go down here, right click and go all the way down to side chain to this track only. Make sure it says only. Not this one, not this one, not this one. Side chain to this track only. Boom. So now every time you record, your vocals is going to be routed to track three that has the preset or whatever channel you want yours on. All right. So now before you start recording, you want to make sure that this button right here is armed and the record button is armed and highlighted. So this is going to be good for when you want to do quick punches as well. So I'm going to show you what I mean. So I'm going to record right now. Yeah, uh, watch how I do it. I don't make excuses. Shout out to the shooters. Right? So to stop recording, you see it right here, highlight it, hit the letter R on your keyboard, and that's how you arm and disarm that. So uh, I don't want it armed when I'm listening to the playback. Otherwise, it's going to record or whatever. So... All right, so that this little piece right here should be routed automatically to channel three. So let's see. Watch how I do it. I don't make excuses. Shout out to the shooters. All right, so, and then if you want to do quick punching, all you got to do is make sure that this is armed, hit the letter R on your keyboard, and just hit the space bar and keep going. Shout out to the shooters. Put one up into you, and none of them do you. And then you can stop. You can stop and just wherever you want to pick up from. And I never do it. Uh, I never did it. Uh, I never did it. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm about to go crazy. I'm about to go crazy. I watch how I handle it. Crazy. I'm about to go crazy. I watch how I handle it. It's hot like I live in Los Angeles. It's hot like I live in Los Angeles. These early the gym, they be scandalous. All of these tech takes is gonna go to the preacher's the preset track. The shooters put one up into you. And I never do it, uh, I never did it, uh. yeah, yeah, I'm about to go crazy, I'm about to go crazy. Hey, I could really rap though, don't, I'm just doing this for tutorial purposes, don't, don't try to come for me. So yeah, that's how you, that's how you do that, alright, so hopefully that was helpful, and uh, we're gonna go on to the next comment. What should I do when my beat is sounding under my vocals? After recording, my beat is still sounding in the channel. I recorded my vocals in the mixer. All right. So you're saying that every time you record, your vocals and the beat is on the same track, right? All right. So if you do it exactly how I just showed you just a second ago, you shouldn't have that problem. But always remember, uh, assign your, your beat to its own track and make sure that your recording track is... Nothing should be on your recording track other than your microphone and external and mixer input. That's the only thing that should be on your recording channel. And then route it to whatever channel you want. Yeah, so just make sure that 
you're assigning your beat to its own channel and make sure that you're routing your vocals to a channel and make sure you hit side chain to this track only. All right. Also, I do have vocal presets. So make sure you guys jump in the description, hit the link, go over, get you a vocal preset. All right. So the last comment that I'm going to reply to says, I like your tutorial, but I'm having an issue. I'm doing everything up to where you say hit the yellow mix button. Mine doesn't say mix. It says pre, and when I click on it, it says post. I have FL Studio 28.3. 20, Please help me get started. Really appreciate you. Thanks. All right. So, yeah, that's one thing. You do have to make sure you have the latest uh, update with FL Studio. They're on FL Studio 24, I believe, right now. So make sure if you purchased it, you should have, you know, a free upgrade or whatever. So make sure you do that. And uh, I'm just going to show you real quick how to deal with that little issue. So you say when you when you hover over, first of all, the yellow button is not going to be uh, exposed until you hover the mouse over it. Then it's going to light up yellow. Then you have to make sure you go down to external and mixer input. Once you do that, then it's going to change to the word mix. Now you said yours say pre and then when you click on it, say post or something like that. But it don't even matter what it says. Just click on it and go to external and mixer input, and it should change to the word mix. After that, you really shouldn't have any problems recording. But if you do, leave it in the comment. I'll hit you up directly or make a video. So hopefully these little tips help you guys record and get started. If you have any questions, like I said, I can't stress it enough. I'm always here to help. That's what this channel is, to help. So make sure y'all comment, reach out to me. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. Get this video a thumbs up if it was helpful at all. I appreciate all y'all. Make sure y'all hit the link in the description. Go get you a vocal preset. Check out some of my music. We just dropped a new project called Mafia Motion. Until the next time, we out. All right? Peace.